Well, happy Sunday. Happy Mother's Day to happy all you. Happy Mother's mother. Day. Happy Mother's Day. Um, we are almost at Toys R Us right now. Um, Ashley has a return to make, but other than that, I received a 15% coupon in the mail, and I want to see what I can get um, Gavin for his birthday. I already have him a, a box started, a theme box, and I want to see if I can find something else to add to that theme box. Um, and then, if we... We're supposed to be home at 2 uh, so that Andrew and Christina can come over. Um, but if we, so if we have time when we leave here, we're going to also, uh, Ashley has a return to make to Target. So, and it's only a $5 return. And well, that's how she said it. She said it's only $5, but to me, that's $5 and, and I don't like to waste money. So, um, and that's the good thing about having a red card is she does not have her receipt but she has her red card and um, she bought this item on that card so they can look it up in the system and see that yes she bought it um, if you didn't have a red card then there would be no way for them to, to keep track of that so um, anyway that's what we're doing right now and um, if I see anything interesting in Toys R Us I'll show you but I already did a big long vlog at Toys R Us of all their cool, cool stuff. So I probably won't film very much. He shares. Can I have this one? Make him make that noise. Andrew and Christina just left. We finished pricing their yard sale stuff. They have a lot of baby items to sell um, that they don't think they're going to need. And Ashley, I will show you what she's doing right now. Ashley is um, in here looking through old school stuff. I have kept kindergarten through 12th grade in these folders like this and kept them in this container. And um, she is deciding what she wants to keep and what she wants to go. Is all that going? That's all going, yeah. All going. And hold up the sweater that your daddy made. Kevin actually made this sweater for her, and he used to make her, um, it's been folded up, that's why it's wrinkled, but he, um, he made her dresses, and I think there's some dresses in there, aren't there? And uh, he's made... I don't know, I haven't gotten that far. Oh yeah, there's some dresses. When we get down there, I will show you the dress he made for Ashley. I'll show you this paper that Ashley wrote, and she didn't want to keep it. It says, once my Aunt Jennifer had a shirt. It was awesome. It was cool because it was strapless. I wanted it so <laughs> bad. <laughs> That's hilarious that you wrote that. Once I rode a bus and it was not a pleasant experience. There were two little boys saying things that should not be said or heard. I was talking to someone, and they were fighting beside me. They said some things. That's hilarious. Is this like a journal? 
Um, is that, I don't know. There's one that's called The Babies, and it's a packet about that thick, and it's like a whole series I wrote about these freaking children. On these little outfits that were Andrew's, uh, Andrew actually came home in this one, I believe, and this is the outfit that Ashley came home in. Um, this little pink outfit, and then she wore this hat all the time, and I'll probably keep that because it's really cute, and when she has a baby, we'll make the baby wear it. Uh, this is a dress that Kevin made Ashley, and it's just a, a simple little sleeveless, sleeveless dress, but those were really nice for her to wear to uh, school. And it has a zipper. Oh, yeah, it works. I'll keep it. And then he made this Little Miss Muffet outfit. And if I can find a picture, I will insert the picture of Ashley in this outfit. It has an apron and the dress. And then it also has little bloomer pants, which I hate. The little pantaloons and the cap. And the cap. And we have a picture of her in all of that. And he... He did an excellent job. She was Little Miss Muffet for her school program, and he did an excellent job for that. I remember them parading me around the school to show the people in the office, look what her father made her. Yes, because Kevin That's can cool. do anything. He can make sweaters, and he can sew, and he can perm hair and cut hair. And, and what can Mommy do? <laughs> Mommy can complain. <laughs> yes, she can. And demand that he make something for her. Yeah. Purses. He made me purses. This is the final pile of stuff that is getting recycled. It's not very big. It doesn't look doesn't look very bad to me. And the only reason we're getting uh, recycling this shirt is because it has names all over the other side. But that, uh, that doesn't look like very much to me. And all of their old um, baby clothes, Ashley doesn't want them, so I priced them and we'll put them in the yard sale and try to sell them. Oh, how the hostas have grown. Look how big this is. That is a beautiful hosta. And here are the other ones down through here. They get smaller and smaller. You have this huge one, and then you have this one. And then this one on the end. So, um, but they're all pretty. And look, look at the pile of wood there. That is from a wood bee. We, um, uh, I just found some wood on the porch. I'll show it to you. Um, Kevin, hold up. I want to show where it's the, uh, um, they, uh, they have, uh, made, yeah, yeah, well, it's in there now, Kev. How do you know? Yeah, because it's sticking out right there. Oh, yeah, I don't want to do it with the bees, actually. Yeah, it like, is. It yeah, it is actually in there doing Pushing it. it dust. I'm what trying I do to. Is I stick this stuff in there, and then it gets stuck in there. And... Yeah, it is actually in the wood right now, and it's made this hole right here. But um, yeah, and Kevin, there's some uh, down here too. So. Uh, no, Kevin is going to try to fill in the holes, but we get these every year, and I don't know why. I don't, um, I don't remember ever having these at our old house with our fence at all, so I don't understand why they're with here with, with this fencing. They just like this wood, I guess. So, um, there's the pug. They can't hear a thing I'm saying. We didn't know if he'd potty today, so we came out here before it rains, because it looks like it's going to rain at any time. But we've been on the computer. Um, Kevin, we had sent his mom a card today and wished her uh, to a Mother's Day card, but he called her and wished her a Happy Mother's Day. But uh, looks like it's going to rain in just a little bit. And I can't, I can't remember if I said earlier, uh, we, I did spend uh, $45 in um, Toys R Us, but I couldn't show any of it because it's all for uh, Gavin's birthday and Christmas, mainly Christmas. I got him some really good um, Christmas gifts, and those are for his, for his theme box. And then... Um, 
at Target. I bought him a couple little things at Target, too. The only thing I bought at Target that wasn't for his birthday was a box of um, Q-tips. So, nothing, really. Nothing, nothing that I can show. But, I think you all will really enjoy when his birthday comes or when Christmas comes. You'll enjoy seeing what I got because you'll remember me saying that, that I've collected these things and like stocking stuffers and I'm collecting little things. Didn't get any stocking stuffers today, but I looked at some stocking stuffers. Get this. We were in line at Target and Kevin spotted some Band-Aids and they had two different kinds. They had a, a box of... The, uh, did I say Target? at Toys R Us, and um, he spotted ones that said bacon, uh, bacon band-aids or something like that, and they were literally ba uh, band-aids that looked like slices of bacon, and then they had some that were zombie band-aids, and um, so I asked the cashier, I said, how much are these? They were like $6.99 for a little box of probably 20 band-aids nothing just a little tin they were in a tin but that's ridiculous i said well i don't want those then um don't want them that bad but that would have been cute for a stocking stuffer but i'm not spending 6.99 on some band-aids so i'm glad we bought uh brought guido outside because he is he's been successful doing his business so he did have to go because if he didn't go now he would either be sick tonight or he would have to go at six o'clock in the morning and I would rather not deal with that first thing in the morning so he went potty and what are you doing I sealed up those bee holes and there's another one too I see it no, there was another one off the deck, too. I got it. Why do you think we get them here and we didn't get them? Why do you think they like this wood so bad and they didn't on the I other? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know what do so, anyway, it is dinner time. So, we're getting ready to eat. Kevin's going to try some new sausages that he bought. Um, and I plan on eating a grilled cheese with jalapeno. And that sounds really good. So, uh, I'm hungry. And Ashley has gone out to dinner, and I don't know where she was going to eat. So, I'll, uh, I'll show you my sandwich when I fix it. Hey, this is my grilled jalapeno with cheese, and Kevin's finishing up his dinner over there. And I have my uh, Lay's potato chips. And Miss Ashley went to Fang's. Box combo. And got the box combo. What's all that sauce? Is that is deliciousness? That, is that the extra sauce? Yes. The surprise, there they are. And she does not eat her coleslaw, so Kevin eats it. Is it good, Kevin? Is it sweet? No, it's actually kind of bland without salt in it. Oh, you have to add salt? It's a mayonnaise based slaw. But I, I don't add, think they add a lot of sugar to it. I add salt to everything I get at Kate's. Everything. The toast, the chicken, the everything. The toast. I like your shirt. <laughs> she had salted toast. I like that UK shirt. Is that the one you got at um, Fan Outfitters? Fan Outfitters. Yeah, that's a cute shirt. I went to Kane's. I went to the dress barn. And I literally walked in exactly seven minutes before they closed. So it's kind of rushing. So the first thing I bought was this really pretty Calvin Klein top. It was $30. How super cute is that? I don't want to lay it on the table because he just cleaned it with Lysol. Put it across the back of the seat. Put it across the back of the chair. Cool. <laughs> then I bought some Capri pants. And these are Raws and Alley. I've never, I don't know. But they're cute. I've been wanting a pair of Capris. I thought they were really short for some jeans. Ha ha ha. Jerk. And then, the last thing I, oh, and those were... Those were $35, and then, my favorite, this dress, and this is a, this is Roz and Alley 2, and it was $50. And this is actually, it's a maxi dress on me, it goes all the way down to my feet, but I don't technically think it's supposed to be a maxi dress for normal sized people. <laughs> That's cute, how much was that? 50 It's too bad that you don't get a discount. For... I did. I, if you sign up for their mobile text messages, um, they send you coupons like every two weeks. So I got 20% off of all of this. 
So it ended up being like 96 something. It's a good thing they closed seven minutes or you would have bought... You the only, whole store. Right? Yeah, you only bought three things in seven minutes. That's very cute. And it goes to my toes. <laughs> yeah, it does. You'll have to cut those little tags out. Yeah, yeah they're, they'll drop me up. That's a very cute outfit, though. Here is Ashley's dress. Are you allowed... Are you going to wear that to work, or...? Yeah. As long as, I think it might be a little see-through, so I might have to wear a slip under it. I don't think it's see-through. Spread your legs. Oh, yeah, it is a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> Do you have a slip? No. I'm going to buy one at the Walmart. Okay, we've watched Amazing Race, and they're down to their final three. Um, I really like any of the three to win, honestly. All three of them are good. Um, honestly, I root for any of them, truly. Um... The Afghanimals, I like them this year because they were nicer about how they did things and they actually were very good competitors. So I'd like to have seen them go on further, but, but it's okay. I'm, I'm, I'm rooting for any of the three. It really doesn't matter to me. Uh, we've had our showers tonight. Um, we've eaten our snack, and now we're going to probably watch Guys Grocery Games that we taped or, um, I don't know, watch um, uh, Doctor Who or something like that on TV. So we're uh, wrapping up our night, and we'll go to bed soon, and um, have a good night.